Today is Thursday, June 18th. It is 10.32 a.m., you know what I'm saying? It is 10.32, and I am currently about to dash. I have my phone charged, I have enough gas, I have my red card, and I have my hot bag in the back. I'm about to start dashing. It is 10.33 now, and I'm going to be dashing from 10.30 to 2 o'clock. So that's three hours and a half I'll be dashing, and I'm currently at McDonald's. Uh-uh. They just gave me a freaking McDonald's meal for $3.75. Y'all remember yesterday. This is about to be a repeat of yesterday. Nope, I'm declining that one because um, the order is too small. I just got an order at McDonald's for $6. I'm on my way there. It's 11.06. And I'm now starting my first order of the day. And almost got into a fucking car accident. Like, damn. And you know, I gotta be careful because... Because my shirts don't know I'm doing this shit. But I'm three minutes away. And the funny part is, as I was passing the McDonald's, I was hoping to get an order. I was hoping to get an order and I didn't. But as soon as I pass it, that's when I wanna go get a fucking order, right? <laughs> But anyways, it's not that far away. I'm almost there. I'm 30 minutes away. Mm -mm. Alright, you guys. So I just arrived at McDonald's. I'm about to go pick up my order. And I'll be right back. I have a DoorDash order. As you guys see, the order wasn't ready when I got there, um, but it didn't take too long. So I'm about to head over to his house and I'm going to hand it to you. I just arrived to my destination, I'm about to hand it to them and yeah. Bro, that was so weird. Like, she she came out, but when I got on the phone with the person, it was a whole different person. Like, she put the, like, she gave a different number or something. I'm so confused because I was like, who am I on the phone with? Like, who number is this? Then if I, if it's not you on the phone, and I was like, did you put a different number? And she didn't really say anything. I think she has like a disability or something, but. Anyways, I'm about to go back to a hot spot and I'm going to look for another order. So this delivery was smooth. I just got a $6 order for Pizza Hut, but it's seven miles away and there's no way I'm about to take that because the distance is way too long, period. No, thank you. 55% rate All right, I'm gonna do it. I'm only doing it because I don't want my septus rate to go down so much That's it. That's the only reason why I'm doing it. I'm six minutes away from Pizza Hut and I'm about to take that order whatever because Why would they why are they gonna drop my septus rate to 55 if I don't accept it? Because I just started DoorDash and I don't want to have a bad reputation on me because the lower your numbers are, the lower your numbers are, the fewer the fewer orders they're going to give you. Like I 
believe correct me if i'm wrong but i want to keep everything high so that my account is in good standing so that's why i'm taking this order and that's on that <laughs> yeah i'm dead driving on the curb i'm so dead I have a DoorDash order for Col Colina. Okay, can you go off for the door because it's like a box. Okay. Like many things in there. I'm just gonna bring it over for you. All right. All right, no problem. Okay. She said in front of the door. So I hear from the door, whatever. What? This is seventy five dollars. That's a big ass box. <laughs> Where am I bringing this? Yeah, it's like thirty oh personal. Yeah, we have to put it on one box. Uh, thank you. Have a good day. Bro, this is a. Big <laughs> Alright, I'm about to head over to where they're at. This is 160. I'm glad it was already done, y'all. Everything was done. As you guys saw, everything everything um, was quick. So they're like 10 minutes away. I'm about to head over there right now. It's a contactless delivery. I know the order's gonna be that big, y'all, but okay. They eating good. I wonder what they got. They eating good. Turn right into the parking lot. Oh, it's at the hospital. It's at the hospital, y'all. You've entered the parking lot for your destination. <laughs> so this, all this pizza is for the hospital. Arrived. Hi, I'm here with the DoorDash order. I'm here with the DoorDash order for Kalani, Kalina. Where should I place it? DoorDash. I have a door. Sorry, say it again. DoorDash order. I have a DoorDash order for Kalina. Kalina K. Kalina. Oh, okay. Yeah. We're gonna come down for it. Okay. We'll be right there. Where are you? Where are you? By the employee? No, I'm Security? out. I'm outside of the um, building. Okay. I'm outside okay, of the we're building. Down. All right. Got it. Give us a minute. We'll be down. Alright, you guys. So I come, and nobody is literally... Are they here now? Alright, you guys. So I found them. Um, I just told them that it's by the security desk and all that, and yeah. It took forever to come outside though. Like I was like, uh uh look. I just got an order for this place called El Ka El Cuna Deli. This is like a Hispanic restaurant. They sell tacos and all that and they are three minutes away. Starting route to El Cuneo Deli. to give me my order okay all right guys so i'm about to head over to his house um 
it took about five minutes for them to prepare to finish preparing the food and yeah they are how many minutes away they are 13 minutes away i'm about to head over there right now and turn right onto depew avenue okay. thank you have a good day y'all I am 20 minutes. That delivery was quick. That delivery was good, but I'm like a little bit out of my range right now. I'm 19 minutes away from my hotspot, but once I receive an order, you guys, once I get an order, I'll be right back on to the next order. Cha-ching. All right, you guys, so I just got an order for Papa's Pizza. Um, they're four point something miles away. There's a whole train going Starting right now. To <laughs> All right, you guys. So I just made it. I'm about to go ahead and pick up my order. Dang, they took all the parking up front. Okay, I'll come over here. I'll come around. DoorDash shorter from Michael. So I have my meal right here. The food was already ready when I got there. Ow! The food was already ready. You know what I'm saying? And I'm about to go ahead and head over to Michael. Alright you guys, so I just handed him his food. I was actually at the main entrance but I forgot that I was supposed to meet him at the parking lot and I did see him so I just gave him his food. It's about to be 1 o'clock and I'm going to be finishing my shift at 2 o'clock. Anyways, I will see you guys when I have my next order. Alright you guys, so I just got an $8 order at this Conger Diner place. Alright you guys, so I just made it to the diner and as I was driving, I got another additional $5 plus a 1.3 mile um, distance if I add another order from the same restaurant. So of course I snatched that. So that's $13 for these two orders combined and they're only 1.3 miles away from each other. So I'm about to head on into the restaurant and pick up my order. <laughs> Yeah, that was long. I have an order for Anthony and Steve. Are you picking up both? Two, yeah. Well, you can tell her I don't understand it either, but at this point. All right, so I have my order right here. I have the milkshake and I have my first order right over here. And then my second order is behind me, so I'm about to be on my way to my first order. All right, you guys, so I just finished my first of my stacked order. Now I'm about to go ahead and drop off my second order. They're only, they're only three minutes away from each other. So I'm about to head over there and give my second order and yeah. All right, you guys, I just got an order at IHA for $5. Customer is 1.5 miles away. I'm about to be on my way to IHOP right now. I'm probably like five minutes away from IHOP or less hopefully the order is ready once i get there and yeah i'll see you guys once i get to ihop all right you guys so i just made it to ihop i'm about to go right on in I'm like 10 minutes early but i'm still going to go in anyways to make my presence known and all that you know what i'm saying all right no problem i'm about to be on my way right now Okay, do you know what exactly? Yeah. So when I go in there, I can just tell them. Oh, okay. Because All right, you guys, tell me how I go to IHOP. Like I said before, it was so easy to get the order and all that. And I see that the address on the, on the, on the delivery, I see that the address on the app is IHOP. And I'm like, what the fuck is this? Does the person work at IHOP? Why would they deliver through DoorDash if they work at IHOP? I'm confused. So I called the customer before I left because it says that I arrived at my destination, which is IHOP, for her delivery address. And I'm like, that doesn't make any sense. So I call her, I call her, and I'm like, um, excuse me, T, 
Hi, this is Carmise from DoorDash. Um, I see that you put IHOP as your address. What is your residential address? Can you please tell me your residential address? And I will be on my way with your food. And then she's like, oh, oh, you know, um, I'm supposed to, they were supposed to switch out my turkey and my bacon for me because, you know, um, my family don't eat pork. I need turkey bacon and I need turkey sausage. And I'm like, oh my gosh, okay. So I go back inside the restaurant and I tell them all this. And they're like, oh, this is the lady that was supposed to contact us back on the phone to tell us, you know, to switch out that option because we don't have that option on the DoorDash menu. We don't have that option on the DoorDash menu for you to pick what type of bacon that you want if you want turkey or a regular. He said that they don't have that on the, on the DoorDash app. So... He, she was supposed to call them back and modify that order before and it was an upcharge so because they charge more for bacon they charge more for turkey bacon and all that so i have to tell her that when i get there and when she tells me her address she's talking about oh my address was out of range and the cops are right next to me oh my gosh <laughs> and she was like she was like, oh, my address was out of range for delivery for IHOP. So I'm like, so you put the address at IHOP. So I'm like, you put the address at IHOP because your address is out of range. She's like 20 minutes away from IHOP. And I'm just like, okay, that's not that bad. But the fact that I picked up a order for 1.5 miles for $5, why would I go 6 point? I mean, okay, it's not that bad, but why would I go 6.7 miles all the way to IHOP? Why would I go 6.7 miles for $5? You know what I'm saying? I'm about to go there. I don't know if she's going to give me a tip or not. We'll see. And after this, I'm going to be done with my DoorDash session. Okay, so I just dropped off my order. It was pretty easy to find the apartment number. And no, she did not give me a tip. And it's totally okay. She honestly looks like a single mother. And her daughter was the cutest thing in the world. Um, so I'm basically done for the day. I made $45 in 2 hours and 22 minutes, 3 hours and 30 minutes dash time. But anyways, if you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys turn your post notifications so you find every single time your girl upload her videos. And if you guys want more DoorDash videos from me, please let me know in the comment section down below. And yeah, anyways, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.